This is where it all starts, with trees growing in a sustainably managed forest. Here at the Pulp and Paper Mill in Numala, Sweden, Stora Enso and Gossam show the way in the circular economy by converting residue from the process water into renewable energy. The wood is taken to the mill where it's chipped, made into pulp, and then turned into paper, a renewable material. In the process of turning wood into premium office paper, water is gradually removed. The paper is being wound and cut into reels, which are then sent to the copy paper packing line. A stream of residue water is sent to a buffer tank at Gossam's biogas plant next to the mill, where it is optimized with nutrients. The water is pumped into reactors where biogas is produced after organic materials are broken down by bacteria in an oxygen-free environment. The biogas is separated from the purified water, which flows back to the mill. The biogas now consists of methane, carbon dioxide, and some hydrogen sulfide. After being purified, upgraded, and polished, the biogas is cooled down to an average of minus 160 degrees Celsius and turned into liquefied biogas. The liquefied biogas is stored in an insulated tank before it's pumped to trailers. It is then transported to gas filling stations, for example, where it's used to fuel heavy-duty vehicles. The expected production of liquefied biogas at the plant is 75 to 80 gigawatt hours annually, an amount that will keep up to 200 lorries running for a whole year. By using liquefied biogas instead of fossil fuels, the greenhouse gas emissions can be reduced by up to 90%.